Welcome back to the channel. My name is Bill, and my amateur radio call sign is Whiskey X-Ray 4 Alpha Romeo. And today we're going to bring an unboxing. Now, what did I get? A little package here from Gigaparts. This is a mobile radio that I've been saving my pennies, nickels, and dimes for. I'm about to show you what it is. Let's see if I can get it out of this box. Is the Yesu FTM 200D. And uh, let's take a look at this. down all right I uh, first fell in love with this radio well this type of radio when they brought out the FTM 300 but uh, 300 is was a little bit out of my price range not saying that this one's not out of my price range too. It's expensive, but as I said, I've been saving for it. Okay, come on. All right, first thing is manual. Yesu makes fantastic manuals. First thing we have is a power cord. Microphone. Pretty nice looking mic. Okay. Some uh, mounting uh, Hardware, microphone clip, and this is uh, for mounting the uh, head of the radio on your dash or wherever else you want to put it on a desk or someone. A couple extra fuses. All right, this is the cable that goes from the body of the radio to the head of the radio, and it's plenty long enough. I'm probably gonna put the body of the radio under my front seat and uh, the head, of course, on the dash somewhere, so I'll probably need maybe three feet, four feet of this at the most. And here's the body. Oh, it's heavy. Okay. And on the back, SO239, power cord, of course, uh, external speaker B, external speaker A, and a data port. I imagine the data port is for uh, doing uh, software updates. And what's nice about this is these, this little clip here. And it comes right off the mounting bracket. And it slips right back on. Very, very nice. Get that out of the way. Uh, okay, this is the uh, programming cable. This is for doing, I believe, software updates. box here and here's the, uh, the head of the radio this uh, radio is very easy to see especially for us old guys or 
having a hard time seeing sometimes. Take this off. Wow, I, I just love doing that. All right, let's see. Uh, let me put my glasses on so I can see even better. All right, this looks like volume control. This is the uh, VFO. The uh, VFO memory button, AB. GM, I'm not quite sure what that means, but we will find out. Uh, on off button and lock, F menu, PMG, which is really neat. And I'll get into that later. DISP, I'm not sure what that is. This is the squelch button and back button. And this is the band and group button. Okay. This is the Yesu FTM 200. D. So we're going to uh, put it together, power it up, and uh, see what it looks like. So stay with us. All right, sorry for the mess. Before I power it up, I just want to show you this ridiculous setup I have. There's the radio. I have hooked up to a power supply, and I have a, a SWR meter. I got the antenna on a cookie sheet. So, if I do transmit at all, it'll be very low power just to see if I can hit anything. Okay, let's power this on and see what happens. Well, power it on. Move this away so I can see what I'm doing. All right, please enter your call sign. The call sign is W X four A All right, I'm not sure how to enter this, so stand by, let me look at the book. Okay, according to the manual, after you put your call sign in, you just press and hold the dial button. The radio shuts off and then should restart on its own with my call sign, WX4AR. And there she is. Okay, well, let me uh, fool around with a little bit uh, so I get an idea of what I'm doing, and I'll come back. Okay, what I did was I just uh, put the local repeater in the memory. What I did was I put the frequency in, and then you go, you hit the F button, and the, you can put in the, the repeater shift, you can put in the tone, and all that. And I'll go over that again in a future video, but I just wanted to give you an idea of what it looks like. like gives the frequency and then the, the tag I have Davenport which is a local repeater here and the repeater's call sign WC4PEN and that uh, right there is in memory so I'm going to play around with this for a while and uh, when I get to understand a little better there will be uh, future videos so uh, thank you so much for uh, joining me uh, if you like to this video please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and uh, stand by for more content 73 and good DXing